Hey, Keith F. Shovel here for Keith's Friday Night Reads. Wrapping up this week. Oh, uh, I'm up to 100 books read this year. Need to get... Uh, it's been November, so I have some time. I'm probably going to do a lot of quick reads over the next couple weeks. Uh, I am very close to finishing my next fiction book that I'm reading, which is 2034, a novel of the next world war by Elliot Ackerman and Admiral James Trevridis. After that, Trevridis. After that, I'll be reading Jail for Freedom by Doris Stevens, a history of the uh, suffragette movement and the women's white rights move for vote, which has a bit of a tie to the history of here where I live in Lorton, Virginia. After that, I'll be reading Headshot by Rita Bullwinkle, which is the top fiction book up for awards and recommended by former President Obama. And then there's a family history book that I hope to knock off this week as well, The Irish Lumberman Farmer, which goes into the family history of the Fitzgeralds and the Harrigans. Whether it's actually connected to Fitzgeralds and my family, all I hope to find out. But it does connect with Harrigans and their uh, connection to one Bing Crosby and where he fits in the family tree in that book. So interesting if I could make that connect, have always worth stories of connection of my family, but on my mother's side to Bing Crosby, this would be on my father's side if it makes it work. But uh, thank you for watching. If there are any books you recommend, leave it in the comments below. If there's anything that I've read that I didn't do a review on and you want to hear more about, hit me up, let me know. Uh, like and share, and uh, hopefully I'll have more to report on next week. Have a good weekend. Happy Veterans Day.